Right, here's my latest bruise of Makali, the one on the left, that was started uh, about five days ago, and that was made with, um, it's, you can see it's slightly yellowy in colour, that was made with uh, chapsal, which is a sticky, glutinous rice, and it's probably, technically speaking, dong dongju, uh, though I can't seem to find out exactly what the difference is between dong dongju and uh, makali. And the one on the right here is made with uh, hepsal, that's... Uh, the standard rice you get in most restaurants with a meal and that's uh, whiter in colour as you can see and that is probably, though I'm not quite sure, technically makali and uh, I don't know if you can see but uh, it says some movement in there, little bits bubbling around and moving upwards and this one here uh, this one was ready two days ago to actually uh, um, sort of decant, if you like, and add sugar to and put in bottles. And I'm going to do that in a moment. But it's that's still that's still fermenting, and it will do for probably about another three weeks, even in the fridge. And this one here is a that's probably going to be ready in about two days time two or three days time that'll be ready to drink now I'm going to uh, I'm going to show you inside uh, if I can inside them uh, first the uh, first the macaulay I see that that's uh It's bubbling away quite nicely. And I can smell it from here. I can smell the slightly sweet alcoholy smell. And this one here, which needs a stir. Now I'm going to go and bottle them up, or bottle the, uh, the dong dongju up, that one there.